know, he has 13 out of 14 knockouts in his last fights, stopped everyone at welterweight. How do you also prepare for power that perhaps Terrence Crawford? Man, who the fuck he fought, man? What are you talking about, man? Who he fought? 13 of us, who the hold on, guys? Derek James staying his feelings about Terrence Crawford. I don't know what is it with these two, bruh. Good God. It ain't no reason for Derek James to be acting up and be frowning up his face and be getting upset and be throwing a tinter tantrum and all this other stuff every time you hear Terrence Bud Crawford. But he's sitting up here, a coach and all this other stuff, a trainer, and you know what I'm saying? You got a fighter and your fighter is fighting this guy and he up here talking about who, 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 who? Who you talk? Who you think he talking about? Pair for power that perhaps Terrence Crawford. What you mean? Where did your brain go that fast? Like he's so irritated, man. They didn't want this fight, man. They didn't want this fight. I ain't never seen two dudes act so in they feelings about somebody else in my life. And this is the other thing. He quiet. <laughs> Terrence Crawford. He ain't even. He ain't even boastful about his shit. He not. He humble about it. He let his work speak for itself. See, this is the thing that irritates them about Terrence Bud Crawford. This is the thing. See, they call themselves this, that, boogeyman, whatever. The truth is, is that the third. Terrence Crawford don't say nothing about himself. Everything that's said about Terrence Crawford, we say it. It comes straight from the people. You don't hear Terrence Paul Crawford saying he anything. You don't. Other than what he's confident and what he can do and how he look at himself. But other than that, he don't go around big fishing and all that. He don't. It, Terrence Crawford don't do that. All these accolades they get irritated about, and, you know what I'm saying, mad about, and upset about, and all this other stuff. Come from boxing fans. The people who observe them, people who are a fan of them, people who watch them. People see them, people have observed the same fights that y'all getting upset about y'all saying that he ain't nothing, this, that, the third. But this is the point. This is the whole point. This is how you know Derek James. They they just on some they just on some bitch time shit. At this point, what do it matter? Hmm? Hmm? What? Are you sitting up there talking about well, who is he fought this and that? If your guy fighting him, what would that say about your guy? But on top of that, at this point with the fight made, that argument, that point that you bring it up, what does it matter? You say that to say as if that's some kind of reason why, well, he did it against those kind of guys. So what happened when he do it against your kind of guy? Everybody knows, see, this is the thing about Derek James. Everybody knows on top of this fight, the most interesting thing beyond just these two guys fighting in the ring is us sitting up here listening to you struggle, trying to instruct Errol Spence how to beat Terrence Crawford. <laughs> Mr. Uh, trainer of the year. <laughs> That's what you're going to have to do. That's what you're mad about. <laughs> and I can't wait. I want to hear you coach him up out of this. You know what I'm saying? I want to hear you give them the instructions when he ain't got the answers. We going to see what you say. Just as much, <laughs> this is the whole thing, just as much as Errol Spence ass going to be on the line and on display, so is Derrick James. And he know it. You know it. That whole thing going to explode. Because that whole coach, you see, because... The whole Crawford thing, he's not just a threat to Spence and all that. He a threat to Derrick James, too. Why you think he acting up? In, uh, I mean, because look how he be acting. He be turning up his face. But <laughs> when he did it, Terrence Crawford, when you bringing him up? Well, I'm sick of people bringing up Terrence Crawford. And if this, if this is the guy that you say he was eventually going to have to fight and your man was keeping his promise, why are you so upset that people bring him up if you say he was going to keep his promise? So eventually you guys are going to talk about him anyway, so why are you so irritated? It don't make no sense with Derrick James at the end of the day. But this shit is funny. Like I said, and I can't wait. Like, comment, subscribe. Who's playing him out?